What's up, everybody? It's your boy, Buff Ass Jabbar, the self-proclaimed Burby King, and I'm going to keep calling myself that to one of y'all challenge me and strip me in my title. Um, people want to know how some people could be doing burpees and re be really good at burpees and can do a lot, but their body don't really reflect that. Um, and there's three things that you can be doing wrong to completely kill your burpee games. And I'm going to show you the right way and the wrong way to do them. So the first thing, obviously, is not enough intensity. Either you're not going hard enough, you're resting too long in between burpees, or you're just not doing enough. The second thing is actually how you perform the, bur the burpee. So I see a lot of people kind of just slap their body down there and pop themselves back up. Uh, I'm going to show you how to do that the wrong way, and then I'll show you the right way. So this is the wrong way to do it. That's the wrong way. You're not giving the push-up enough time to develop. This is the correct way to do it. So you see I hit every point of the push-up and it's a full extension push-up, it's not a half push-up. I let my chest get all the way to the floor and I lock my arms out before I pop back up. The last thing that you could be doing wrong to kill your burpee gains is dipping your hips. So I'm gonna show you the wrong way. That little recoil makes it easier to pop yourself back up, but you're taking away from the muscle development. So I'm gonna show you the right way to do that. Notice at no point did my hips dip inward. Give the push-up all of its respect, take your time with it, and get the job done.